out here in Moreton Bay testing the new Maracuja Zume, which is a synthetic worm bait. It's actually been designed to fish with your standard hook and sinker rig, so like a Pananoska rig or a standard sinker swivel trace to your hook with your little red tubing. Um, oh. And what we're actually doing is we're just drifting along nice and slow, bouncing our baits off the bottom. What have we got here? A little whiting. So, okay, this is what we've come to catch. A little whiting, diver whiting. As you can see, there's a chewed up piece of worm on here. The other bait I've got on is actually corn. That's what this fella actually ate. So, trying a few different baits, let him go. Okay, this is your standard extra large Azume worm, and all we do with it is I'll just break it into a few pieces. So I've got a couple of pieces here. Normal long shank mustard size six hook. I'll just thread it through the, like you would a normal worm, just thread it through the middle, slide it over your hook. Same thing, just a little piece. So all we're going to do is just lob it out, let it hit the bottom, and slowly just bounce it along the bottom. Whiting are a very, very aggressive species, and once the bait gets in front of their face, they just keep biting onto it. And we're fishing over weeds, so we're actually using a pan and Oscar rig, so the sinker's on the bottom, and you're not tangling up with your hooks all the time. And what you're trying to do is just bounce it through the weed onto the nice, calm, sandy patches where the whiting like to hang out. The beauty of it too is, like you can see here, that little piece of bait I've put on has just slid up the hook so I can take the whiting out and the bait's ready to go again. So quite often you'll get three or four up to a dozen whiting on the one little piece of bait, so it's very, very good value for money.